Busy day in the clubhouse before the game today. Four youngsters, U.S. national ping pong champs, came on to play against the Orioles. Some of the Orioles didn't want any part of it. They just wanted to watch. These kids were unbelievable. Buck Showalter's our reporter from the clubhouse. Buck? Our guys stay obviously very loose, and it's their clubhouse. And uh, these youngsters came in today, and uh, I think three of them are supposed to represent us in the Olympics, next Olympics. Unbelievable, Gary. There is another level. I'm telling you, nobody can hardly get their serve back. The things they can do with a ping pong ball. No, it's interesting. They always had their head behind the paddle, which, you know, I was talking to some of the hitters. Isn't that interesting? Because that's the same theory a lot of hitting coaches talk about. But, uh, unbelievable these kids and we're talking about pound for pound one of the kids is considered the best ping pong player in the world and uh jj hardy as good as he was i walked by him and jay said i said jay why are you sitting here he goes i ain't getting up there mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, some have stayed for the game yeah good group i mean they had a lot of fun in the clubhouse obviously ping pong is a nice you know thing to get a distraction i guess you would say from the rigors of the game so they have it they enjoy it and they had a treat watching some of the best in the world play this afternoon and you saw just how smart J.J. Hardy is he sat and watched yeah definitely.